So what happens after your warranty runs out on your electric vehicle? Now, uh, I mean, this is generally true for just about any vehicle that you own that's outside of warranty. Uh, the cost li lies on you. Now, what's great about our product here uh, at Accelerate with Xcare is that even if you're out of warranty, you still have the Xcare warranty to lean on. And you can speak to a group of EV specialists that are, have been in the EV space for well over a decade. We have a significant amount of understanding of components and technology involved to be able to kind of guide you on what is the best recommendation, uh, whether it is to fix it or what the issue is. Uh, now, there are a lot of tools and resources out there depending on which EV you own. Uh, one of the good things about buying a used Tesla is uh, you can do remote diagnostics. We partner with a company called RepairWise that will be able to do remote diagnostics uh, at the time of whenever you have a claim so we can all understand and see what the issue is with the vehicle before you even get to service. This adds a layer of transparency that we can relay over to you so everyone is more in the know. So when you or we are speaking to the service center, uh, we have a better understanding of what is going on for us to ask better questions and help diagnose your claim faster. At the end of the day, we really want to kind of speed up the claim process and make sure that you get your car taken care of and back on the road as quickly as possible. Without the X-Care warranty, you could be exposed to a significant amount of repair costs. Now, when it comes to an electric vehicle, the, the frequency of failure is significantly less than that of a vehicle that uses gasoline or diesel or any sort of combustion me mechanism. Now, although your frequency is lower, and the sheer amount of components is significantly less in an electric vehicle than it is a gasoline vehicle. If something were to break or fault or some sort of internal error and it requires a component to be replaced, oftentimes service centers opt to replace the component rather than repair it. And this drives up the cost of repair. Let's just say your screen stops working and that's the screen inside your vehicle that's on your dash, what we call you say your infotainment system or media control unit or you know, a lot of our PCM, if it's Porsche, a lot of manufacturers call it something differently. Generally speaking, that can be anywhere between two to $5,000, depending on which vehicle, make, and model we are specifically talking about. Does it happen to every single owner? No. Is there anything you can do to prevent that screen from going out? No. And this is where it gets tricky. So it really is kind of a roll of a dice. There's not much you can do to prevent these things from going from faulting, uh, but if it does occur, which it's not guaranteed to occur, but if it does occur, it could be fairly costly. What we call the charger, the component inside the car that actually puts the energy into your battery whenever you plug it in. Not the cord, but there's something inside your vehicle that actually allows that power conversion to go, when you plug it in, to charge that battery. If that were to fail, one, you're not able to charge your car anymore, which is gonna be pretty dire, but two, that could be fairly costly. That can range anywhere between $1,500 to $3,000. Once again, depending on which vehicle make and model we're specifically talking about here, is it guaranteed that that's gonna go out for you? Absolutely not. Does it happen to every single owner? No. Does it happen to most EV owners? No, it does not. Does it happen to some? Can it happen to you? It may. And this is why we created Xcare, to give that peace of mind to people. So if something were to happen, which is not guaranteed, which you most often cannot prevent it from failing, you are still covered. So you don't have to save up a rainy day fund or always be on the edge of saying, well, what if something happens, what am I going to do?